Sprint Car Series, things just got real! Into turn one they go, Jonathan Howard up around the outside of Jake Hall at three wide off of turn two. Here's Andy Forsberg diving down underneath Jake Hall and can't make the pass. They're beginning to filter themselves out through the pack. It's the three of Jonathan Howard, your leader, Jake Hall at second. The 7C, Andy Forsberg is third. Colby Copeland fourth, Matt Peterson fifth. Into turns one and two they go. Becker gets in. Bradley Terrell upside down. Terrell okay on the scene. Hollett's running second. Copeland is third. We're through turns one and two. And we're back under green. There goes Copeland past Hollett. Colby Copeland now has got open track in front of him trying to run down Jonathan Allard. Forsberg past Hollett. Hollett's going backwards. Eight laps on the board. 22 to go. Allard takes off a wheelies. Colby Copeland beats him to the line. Colby Copeland is your leader. Issues for Ivan Warden upside down on the front straightaway. Ivan Warden upside down in the 63. 14 down, 16 to go. There goes Allard. He caught a flyer on Copeland. Copeland wheeling a little bit. Problems for Hollett. He gets into Shane Golubic and Hollett's upside down. Red, red, red. Red, red, red. That is Jake Hollett upside down over there. He got freight trained by Shane Golubic, who had absolutely nowhere to go. Marissa Polizzi late on the scene. All drivers okay on the scene. Originally getting upside down again was Jake Hollett. 16 to go, one less than half. Back off. So still anything up for grabs. Well, there's issues over there for second place, Kobe Copeland. I got word from Dean Mills, our, our videographer up here, that the 5B might have a tire going down in the right rear, but now Mike Andrietta is over there as well. I don't, I don't feel Taking a look at the 5B right rear. So obviously there's something going on over there in the right rear of second place running Kobe Copeland in the 5B. So we might have to head back to the uh, pits to get that thing changed out. Copeland's going to try to bring it back up with some heat. Here we go. Green flag back out. There goes Forsberg by Copeland for position. Andy Forsberg up into second. Copeland tries to fight back underneath Andy Forsberg. Can't make the pass. That right rear's not helping him out at all. Problems for Dan A. Lynn in the 52. He's got handling problems. White flag in the air. Aller down the backside for the last time. He's got Cohen Shaw in the crosshairs. Down to the bottom goes Jonathan Allard, but off of turn four, your winner. Civil War round six is Jonathan Allard. Off of turn number four, Justin Sanders is second. Third is Andy Forsberg. Fourth, Jeff Ensign. Fifth to Jason Toft. Your Civil War presented by Flowmaster winner tonight. J.A. Jonathan Allard. Jonathan Allard, two nights in a row. You're in victory lane. Uh, it's got to feel good uh, teaming up with Clark Riola and getting a victory like this. Yeah, Clark's done a great job. Um, he's he's added some value to the team. Um, you know, Richard got us lined out pretty well coming into this, and uh, Clark's taken right over and, and really uh, brought this thing to the party. So we have a great race car. Uh, we've tried some new things, and it's really working out. I want to thank Clyde and Marion for supporting me and 
allowing me to do this with the race car and change some things around and trusting that it was the right thing. So uh, I think we have a lot to look forward to in the future. And uh, it was a rough, great racetrack tonight. Uh, very technical, very uh, challenging to say the least. I thought Kobe Copeland was going to steal one away from me, but uh, unfortunately he got a flat tire. But, you know, that's the way the cookie crumbles. We'll take it.